So I'm sure you guys have heard by now that Microsoft has acquired Activision Blizzard. Happened yesterday, or at least, you know, I got the news. I saw the news yesterday. Acquired for just shy, uh, a couple of shy of seven billion. Fucking insane. Seven billion. I mean, I don't know if Activision Blizzard is worth this much. But okay, overall with that. Uh, now, of course, some people, you know, criticize. That there's like mixed feelings about it. Uh, of course, you know, it's, it's a, one of which the Monopoly. Everyone talking about Monopoly. Oh, Microsoft is monopolizing and whatever the fuck. But I guess it's okay when Disney and Microsoft do it, right? I mean, if I have fuck you money, I buy all the Japanese uh, gaming company, Capcom, Konami, uh, Platinum Games, uh, Taiko? I don't know if it's Taiko. Uh, you know, the guys behind Ninja Gaiden, they were live, etc. Right? They would look at me like, oh, you're monopolizing and I'll probably get in trouble. No, it's totally okay Microsoft does it. It's totally okay when Disney does it. Uh, and there's some articles about it too. Uh, over here, let me see if I can find it. Uh, there's something like um, you know, is it is it great for gaming, basically? You know, it's great for Microsoft buying these companies buying these studios, but is it great for gaming? Uh, who the hell knows? But yeah, that's that's the that's the latest news. One of the latest news. Microsoft has owned Activision Blizzard. Uh see what they uh, do with it. Now, this probably mean that uh you know, Activision and Blizzard games will probably come to Game Pass. I don't know if all of them will come to Game Pass or a good chunk. Uh, if Diablo 2 comes to Game Pass, that would be cool. Uh, for those who have not gotten the Diablo 2 Resurrect yet, and if you have Game Pass, it may come uh, to Game Pass. So definitely definitely do check it out. Diablo 2 is a, was a, still is, I should say, a great game. And the remastered version, I think, did a a really good job, you know, capturing the classic. Now, I'm sure it has nothing to do with the controversy, right, uh, Bobby? Nothing to do with controversy. <laughs> oh, man. So, th this guy has some fucking nerve. Uh, so, uh... I don't. I, I cannot see any other reason, right? Why this this should happen? Why Microsoft bought them off? Uh, because well, because of this, right? I'm sure. I'm sure this helped. Uh, because because you know if if you guys remember, uh, forgotten. Uh, Activision Blizzard has been going... I think it's just Blizzard. I don't know about Activision. Uh, Blizzard has gone on the fire for... Uh, well, you know... Uh, they got me too, basically. And... Um, uh, some Evans had come out. I believe I haven't looked into them. Uh, but... Yeah, that, that was that was going on. And I think uh, Bobby Kotek was... Like one of the main suspects. Uh, don't remember. It's been like, uh, what was it, a couple months now? I think November this was happening in, or October. But Kote tries tries to uh, make a claim that it has nothing to do with controversy. Blames for uh, uh blames you know. Uh, the delay of Overwatch two and four. Uh, you know, for the decline of stock prices. And I'm like, well, why do you think stock prices were declining? Oh, it's because of the controversy. Right? Right, Bobby? 
All right, Bob, you fucking idiot. Whatever. So, so last I heard, right, uh, I, I'm hearing two different sides to this. Uh, Kotek, well, Kotek didn't want to... Uh, th this has been going on for a while, actually. Microsoft wanted to buy Activision Blizzard, from what I remember. And they didn't want it. Uh, they didn't want that because, uh, from what it was explained to me, right, from uh, my friend uh, Digi, Digital Fracture, he uh, he goes, you know, if, if a company, you know, Microsoft, in this case, buys out Blizzard, they would have all the dirt on Blizzard, and they didn't want that. So they said, no, nah, no, nah, we're not going to sell it. Then this was happening, and it was at a point they don't have a choice. Uh, Kotek, of course, um, you know, resisted. Uh, he argued and whatever. And everyone was like, nah, fuck you, guy. <laughs> We're going to sell it to Microsoft. Uh, they, they just ignored and overruled him, which, yeah, it tells, you know, being a CEO doesn't give you unlimited power. If, it, you know, if no one is on your side, you're done. And the deal was he was supposed to fuck off right take his golden parachute which i hate golden parachutes there's a lot of people who don't deserve it uh you don't know what a golden parachute is uh most simplified explanation i could give you is uh the company goes under uh an executive ceo whatever else uh agrees to leave with a certain payment they walk away with millions of dollars in their pocket is garbage they're the ones responsible right the reason why a company goes under and they get to walk with millions of dollars this asshole is one of them uh he was supposed to take his going to parachute and fuck off you know to the bernie village never hear from again but apparently uh someone from discord call uh yesterday uh mentioned he was going to uh, apparently staying in the company i don't know i haven't looked into it uh I can't look into it uh, right now. I have uh, work in a couple hours. But that's, that's what he said, that he, he's apparently going to stay with the company. So he gets to cast couch uh, more women. That's lovely. Uh, I, I hope he, no. I hope, uh, I hope that's, that's just a rumor someone made up to stir more shit, right? And he's, he's gone for good. So fuck this guy. He's a clown. Uh, I heard. I, I don't hear many good things about Kotek. So no, I, I hope he, he fucks off. By the way, speaking of uh, my buddy Digi, uh, I like how he called him uh, Bob, Bob Coptic. That's pretty funny. But anyway, uh, I, I wanted to see if I can do more of these commentaries. It's just, you know, uh, too much noise in the background basically uh oh yeah anyway uh hope to do more of these i like to do more of these last i did a commentary video was on uh gamestop some years ago when we were going to do this uh this gamestop pass i think it was called a uh, cool deal but then they backed out because it was too pro-consumer i guess to their liking whatever but yeah, I like to do more commentaries because I know people like to watch those more than the less plays. Unless I guess it's a new game. I need to get back to Pray for Gods. Uh, Pray for Gods. I'm going to see if I can stream it uh, after work today. Uh, by the time you watch this, it'll probably be uploaded uh, you know, tomorrow uh, from my stream. So... Along with the, the first session of Pray for the Gods, I'll be a, a link in there. Anyway, uh, that's, that's enough of my rambling. Um, hope you have a good one. Links on the About page, etc. Later.